Bowl revival. <laughs> I can't even imagine me saying it that we've experienced a genuine revival at Asbury University for the last 13 days. God has been tremendously moving over the whole campus, and not only the campus, it went spread all throughout the world. The secular media, the social media, God was there in a miraculous, marvelous sovereignty. It was just pure sovereignty. And I'm so thankful for what God has done and he's continuing to do because now we're, we're having campuses all across the United States, universities, breaking out with outpourings of the Holy Spirit, where the, where the students are just seeking in the Lord, where students are not leaving the chapel. You know, no longer are the students going to bars and getting drunk and getting high and fornicating. Now they're going after God. They're, they're pursuing holiness and purity of life. You know, what's wrong with that? As parents, we want more than anything our children to pursue holiness, to seek after Jesus Christ with all their heart, for Jesus Christ to be the Lord of their life, just not lip service, but Jesus would be the Lord of their life. You see this impact making upon the students there. It's been tremendous. And this is what we're looking for and discipling our kids. We want our kids ultimately to have a personal encounter with Jesus Christ because that's what's going to change their life above and beyond anything else. You know, we can share scripture. We can disciple them. We can do all the practical things with them. But when they have that personal encounter with God, like what the students are having right now at the Asbury Revival, their lives are changing. We're hearing all types of testimonies of them being delivered from pornography confessing pornography they're having the boldness to even confess it praise the Lord they're getting born again they're saying that I was a lukewarm Christian and now I've got a fire within me that's burning and shut up on my bones this is what we want and this is what we pray for our children so earnestly to see them totally sold out to Jesus Christ where everything becomes Christ and Christ alone so let's be encouraged. Let's continue to pray for this revival. I believe it's going to continue to spread. This is not over yet. God is doing a tremendous work.